Alright guys, Sponge Murphy here. Uh, back with another Night Runner video. So I've got 13 of these guys met up. And I think I'm going to be leaving it at that for these for the time being. And to be honest, they're not really the best models to be doing. They're really old. They really show their age. Um, and I'm just not enjoying painting them as much. But I did get a good bit of few of them done. I think there was 18 of them all together. Um, that I had. And um I got 13 painted up and I still have the leader guy that I'm wanting to do so I am going to be painting him up next as well I want to make sure I get him done so um, that will put it up to 14 yeah but as, in, as I said like all models you know like i show you with this guy and this guy this guy has, it has a sling in his hand and he's throwing it and what I didn't even notice I put the hand but his hand is backwards on this and to be honest with you, I didn't even notice it that much until it was like painted and everything. So, you know, just stupid stuff like that. Um, yeah, so let's go through one or two of them just to kind of show what they look like in detail. Let's move the camera down a bit. Um, some of them I went with Codex Grey on their clothes, and some of them I went with Shadow Grey just to mix it up a little bit. Um, like uh, this guy has Codex Grey. I think the Codex Grey is a bit nicer on it. And I just, just kind of did like the basic base coats on them. And some of them I didn't even give them tails. The tails on them are a bit too long and a bit too stupid looking really. So some of them I just left them without tails. Well, about more than half I'd say. Um, and it's a pity because like the story, the fluff with these guys is pretty cool. They're like ninjas. Um, Clan Eshin, I think they're called, or something like that. And you know, like it just it sounds pretty cool, but it's just the models to go with them are terrible. And I tried to give them as much kind of cool weapons as I could. This guy has like the the two claws and like a throne star. It's not even a throne star; it's like a throne disc thing with this big giant monkey hand holding it. Um, yeah, and then I'm still going to be basing these. So what I was kind of thinking of, since they're kind of like ninja guys. I put like a sand base and I'm painting them the colour of rubble and put like bits of wood in it. So as if they're going through like a rubble, like a broke up house or just like a rubble pile in a town or something like that, they're sneaking around. And then um, I try to do something decent for this guy's um, base as well. Because this leader guy, I want him to be pretty stand out on him to look pretty cool. So I put in the extra effort for him. So um, thanks for watching, just keep an eye out for a basin video soon and for the leader guy, I can't remember his name, he does have another name, like a champion name, because that guy can get like a ward save if you upgrade him I think. And uh, thanks for watching, bit of a disappointment, uh, bit of a disappointment with these models, but um, but sure they're done now, I'll get the leader guy done then move on to the next uh, scaven unit. So uh, leave a comment below and hit the like button. And subscribe if you haven't. And once again, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.